I hit that. Ah! Oh, <laughs> not bad. It was not that 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 bad. It was very luxurious review for you guys as you guys know by the title you guys saw i am going to be reviewing this louis vuitton pickup which i don't know if i mentioned the title or not but it is a louis vuitton wallet and i mean by the size of the package i'm pretty sure you can tell it's going to be a wallet anyways or something small so pretty much i asked my mom to pick this up for me from paris because it is cheaper over there this actually came out to be a hundred dollars cheaper than if i would have bought it down here i'm guessing it just saves on shipping costs and all that and on top of that it just it's originated from there so of course it's gonna be cheaper pretty much when you go ahead and buy it it's like a really luxurious feel because once you walk in the store it's already nice you have like a very luxurious feel around you everything's like luxurious about this brand obviously because it's louis vuitton like it's a designer brand you walk in it's very nice in there i really didn't see much i remember my mom was facetiming me she didn't really show me the whole experience but i, I know because i've almost bought something down here but i never ended up buying it pretty much like she told me that there was guards always around her especially when she went to go buy it like when she went to go confirm the fact that she was gonna buy the wallet there was a security guard watching over her in the main paris store that's how crazy they take it over there i'm pretty sure it's because it's like a tourist area they don't know who's gonna come to those doors so that's why they probably have a security guard around you at all times and they like search you to go even inside the store because the store is huge so anyways moving on with the package you do get this box right here They always give it to you with this ribbon and also this tag inside of this tag There's like a little envelope which doesn't really have anything else in it I actually opened it to see what's in there and it's literally just a white card I think it's just in case you want to make it a gift for somebody you put their name in there You put like a little message But if not then I guess it stays empty because I pretty much bought it for myself I ended up paying for it, but she bought it for me over there because she was over there I didn't go to Germany because I had to stay here for school Anyway, they said this is the box You do have your Louis Vuitton right there and on the strap on the bands You do have the three symbols that they use for the monogram and then moving on with that you do have the Louis Vuitton I think it's like a rubber on top of this it sticks to your finger when you pass it over on the bottom of the box there's this blue little tab that you pull and then obviously inside there is the wallet but you still have to get through this right here which is i guess you want to call it the packaging it does have a very nice feel to it and inside finally is the wallet that i got it is this louis vuitton wallet in the black monogram i think it's called the clips monogram i'm not exactly too sure but i'm pretty sure that's what it was called when i saw it on the website and i did get the pinch wallet which is the one that has this clip right here which is where you can put your money and then inside also comes this tag that tells you it is coated fabric and when i first saw this wallet i'm not gonna lie I wasn't amazed because it just wasn't anything crazy to me the only thing that was crazy was the name and finally having a Louis Vuitton wallet it felt really nice but when you look at it in detail you guys can see the stitching is perfect if you guys look at the stitching and the outside it is a hundred percent parallel there's no part where this wallet messes up it is a hundred percent perfectly stitched there's no flaws whatsoever and when you look at the monogram I don't know how they got it on there it doesn't like raise or anything it's not embossed or debossed it's just into the leather I don't know how they did that and going down to the inside what I love about it is that the pockets are part of the wallet they're not like separate pockets so it doesn't make the wallet too thick and also not having another pocket makes it thick either and that's why they put this little clip there so you can hold the money and on there it also says louis vuitton and it says louis vuitton there and then they have like their original seal what they put on all their products and then they have these nice little pockets with this little v cut out shape right there which i'm absolutely in love with it just gives like a nice little detail to the wallet other than that there really is not much else to the wallet the quality is 100 it's perfect these wallets are meant to last quite a few years apparently they're meant to last like 10 years which i wouldn't be surprised if it does because the quality is really good on this what i really want is a book bag which I do plan on getting not anytime soon but eventually I do plan on getting it because it's like a $3,000 book bag anyways guys that's pretty much it for today's video if you guys did enjoy make sure to give it a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe today's the last day of November which means that we do have to get to 20,000 subscribers by the end of today so I hope you guys start sharing the videos commenting and also giving a thumbs up if you do enjoy them but make sure you comment and all I need you guys to really do is just be engaged with these videos because that helps me out a lot one last thing before I go you guys know already what the deal is I do have to give a shout out to the fan of the day and today's fan of the day does go to Nick Singleton anyways guys that's pretty much for today I hope you guys enjoyed this video I'll see you guys the next one make sure you stay woke it's your boy sneaker signing out